Some property owners could be owed money after an error involving property tax assessments. KTRE Shakina Davis explains what happened and how the situation is being handled within the county and the Lufkin IC School Board. The issue goes back to much needed tax relief that was passed by the legislature. The tax roll error affects individuals age 65 and older or disabled persons regarding property tax assessments. Attorney James Guest says there was a mistake made by county assessors in calculating exemptions. The tax bills that went out last year did not include the calculations for the tax relief that was voted in November. Guest says the problem originated from a software vendor used by the county appraisal district. He says each county used different software solutions which affected school district budgets. Some counties sent out notices, some counties um, uh, took other preventative measures, uh, other other counties used uh, entirely different software and did not have this issue. Software is being updated in order to make corrections. Guest says that will lead to refunds for eligible individuals. Lufkin ISD is expecting over $1.2 million in refunds, money that will eventually go back to homeowners who were charged it. Once the district approves the order directing the tax roll corrections, then those who qualify for a refund will then then receive a check in the mail um, uh, from the from the tax assessor collector, Ms. Billy Page. Shakina Davis, KTRE, East Texas News 9. The school board will have a regular meeting this Thursday to vote on whether to approve the changes to that tax rule.